What are the key challenges then facing the agency as you try to deliver more affordable housing in the South West? I mean, as we look forward, uh, we have to recognise there's, there's an election coming and that creates uncertainty. And secondly, whoever's going to be in power in a few months' time, there's going to be a cutback in public spending and one has to fear that that's going to affect the social housing budgets. So what can you do about it? Against that, we simply have got to find ways of working with our partners in the South West, with local authorities, with the housing associations, to get more from less. We need more housing, there's going to be less money. How are we going to do it? We've got to make better use of public land, local authority land, uh, uh, other land holdings that uh, belong to government agencies. We've got to find ways where we can live, leverage in the private sector with the money that they have. We've got to make the taxpayers' public pounds simply go further. Easier said than done, I fancy. Yes, but the approach we take of the, of the taxpayers' pound is to see that we want to invest money uh, rather than just granting uh, and, and, and giving money. We want to do so in partnership and bring in the private sector, work with the private sector, work with landowners, work with developers, work with housing associations and most importantly with local authorities. They have assets. We will have some taxpayers' money. Let's put them together to, to be more effective and get more houses for the money that we have.